Greetings everyone, Rich Grogan, Grogan's Academy of Martial Arts. I hope you're having a terrific day. Hey, we just finished up uh, this evening at the studio. We did uh, bullying awareness seminars for all our classes, and it's similar to the seminar that I do for the, uh, the school districts when I go around. And one thing I wanted to share with you real quick is something we do, uh, kind of an example, an illustration of the mental scars that uh, verbal bullying can cause. And what I do for the uh, students is I, I show them and uh, our bullying duck. If you look at our bullying duck there, he's a cool little guy. He says, be a buddy, not a bully. I'll just put him in front of my face there. Courage, confidence, I'm a hero. So I show him this duck and I talk about uh, coloring, who loves the color. Everybody loves the color because coloring is a self-expression. You can color whatever color you want. But I talk about there's no scars on this piece of paper. It's just a clean, crisp piece of paper. And this is how it feels to be confident, to be full of uh, courage and to feel good about yourself and no one's bullied you. So then I have him take a duck and crinkle it all up. So we crinkle it, wrinkle it all up, and then step on a little bit, and then we unroll it. And now I want you to look. You can zoom. Let's look at the scars on that on that paper. The duck clearly is not the same. He's all wrinkled up, scarred up. And what I tell the students is, I want you to take a middle image of this picture here and think about this. Because every time you say something mean to somebody or somebody says something mean to you, it causes these mental scars that are there forever. Similar to if you cut your finger, you've got a scar for life because your finger, you know, bleeds and then it heals up. But that scar is always there. Well, when mean words are said, bullying's done, the mental bullying, if you can see again, I'm holding it right up there, you see those scars in that duck. And that duck will never look like the original one again because those scars will always be there. They might be hidden under the surface, but it doesn't take a lot to bring those scars back out. So I want you to think about that the next time uh, in parents and uh, instructors pass that on to your students you can give this an example if you like but think about those mental scars that'll be there forever so get out there and do what you can to make a difference in the world but remember be a buddy be a hero be awesome and be kind to others have a great day i'll talk to you soon bye-bye